I'm Wade Gibbs, and for this hands-on project for IEEE Spectrum, I will be making an electric guitar in just one hour, as well as a sensor glove that I can use to play a virtual violin. The centerpiece of this project is the Ototo circuit board. As soon as the kit arrived, my son and I hooked it up to whatever produce we had lying around in the kitchen and made a simple food organ. As I played the notes, he used the potentiometer to control the vibrato. The kit includes the Ototo PCB, a slider sensor, a photo cell, a rotary potentiometer, a simple manual, a set of alligator clip cables, which you can use to connect any conductive object to the note keys on the circuit board, and three wire cables for connecting sensors to the four headers on the board. I also bought a pair of small rechargeable speakers, which connect to a headphone jack on the Ototo. The Ototo has 50 different voices built into it. You can use the sensors to modulate the pitch or timbre of most of the voices, although not many of them make use of the input from this fourth sensor header. I use the Ototo board to create a sort of electric guitar out of nothing more than some poster board, and a spare piece of wood, some portable speakers I found on a popular online shopping site, some strips of aluminum foil, and a few sensors that came with the Ototo kit. These are the speakers, the foil strips, and then the uh, Ototo board is on the back, connected through these bolts to the foil strips by alligator clips. The uh, sensors are mounted up on the neck here. We've got the slider, a photo cell, and a knob. Uh, all of the inputs from the sensors and from the uh, pickup contacts are passed through a USB uh, output cable into a laptop here, which is running uh, Apple's main stage software. My slider here controls a virtual slider, which I've connected to a sort of vibrato control. And then the photo cell, which is uh, connected to this VU meter here, is uh, wired up to act like a pitch bender. So it took me only about an hour to cobble together this little instrument, but it works remarkably well for what it is. I next turned to making a sensor-enhanced glove for controlling the intonation and expression of an instrument with one hand, while I play the notes of a synthesizer keyboard using the other hand. I connected a flex sensor and two four sensors through an LM324 quad op amp and then to the Atoto sensor inputs, which accept a variable voltage signal between zero and five volts. As with the guitar, I used the Atoto's USB MIDI interface to transmit the sensor states to music software running on a laptop which then combined that data with note inputs coming from a Yamaha synthesizer keyboard. By using my fingertips to apply pressure to the four sensors, I could change the playing style from sustained to legato to slid or portamento, and also control the speed of the vibrato. Opening or closing my hand changed the input from the flex sensor, which controlled the volume of the notes. I've never had a violin lesson in my life, but with a little practice, I could make music that sounded like I'd been playing for years.